is. I know he saved our lives, but geez, I guess Althina's guards value combat skill is a lot higher than social skills. Hold on, who's the woman in your party, Gwen? Flip. She wears a strange crust of red cloth. She seems to be sick. Was made you weak, girl. She was assaulted by a monster at the top of the spire. Leapt at her from a magical sphere. You barely escaped its clutches. If you hurry, you might be able to catch it. A monster in a magical sphere, you say? At the highest floor of the spire? Exactly as I suspected. Lucia, the destroyer, is within the spire. Follow me, men. We must find Lucia and capture the creature before it escapes into our world. There he goes. A hero. Doing hero things. He fell for it. Never even lied that convincingly to Grandpa. All right, kids. We must get. We must get Lucia to the house. She's getting weaker by the moment. Just uh, jump on board and take this here uh, vehicle. Dead away, hero. Help me bring her over to the couch. Ah, this will do nicely. Okay, hero. You to stay here with Lucia. I'll go downstairs and find a book that tells us how to break the curse. Oh, so so far, you won't. Ah. We having a nightmare, hero. How oh, horrible. You have said that she was the destroyer. Do you really think she is? I don't know what to think. Find Althena as soon as possible. Help me to resume my search for her. Can't look for her yet, Lucia. We have to rest until we figure out how to lift this curse. No time. So far, Will. So far is essence of evil. Strength grows with each passing moment. He regains control of the power he once held. The world will be destroyed. World? Destroyed? I came to stop him. Ah, such pain. Four dragons, Valthina, did not respond when I called to them at the Blue Spire. So far said that he sealed away their power, and if the dragons are helpless, then only the power of the goddess herself will be able to stop Zophar's madness. That's why I am searching for Valthina. That's why you must, why you humans must help me. When Leo is wrong, Lucia came here to save our world, not to destroy it. I can't wait until the arrogant hair splitter realizes how wrong he is about you, Lucia. I mean, the one you who referred to me as destroyer. He cannot understand the true nature of my existence, nor can any human. That's all I can tell you, and for your safety, all you must know. Okay. What does she mean by that, hero? Did Lucia... Is Lucia trying to tell us that she's not human? I am... a uh, Hero, it appears that this curse is far beyond anything I have the ability to cure myself. We need a priest with special training and exceptional power to dispel it. What if we can't find a priest, Grandpa? What else can we do to save Lucia? There's nothing else we can do, hero. I fear that Lucia's life is... Darnation, how could I forget? I believe there's a priest by the name of Ronfar in the village of Larpa. I knew his father back in the day. Good kid. I just pray he can help us. Larpa is on the opposite side of the lake, and you don't have time to journey there on foot. You have to use the boat. I'll get it ready while you bring Lucia outside, all right, my boy? Got jumps. I'd have broken an ankle doing that. Time to go, Lucia. Put your arm around my shoulder and get hold on tight. Yes, we must leave at once. Lucia, I know you're not feeling very well. I need to make sure you, that we're straight about something. Hero is helping you out because he's a nice guy. 
but he's all mine, got it? What do you mean by that? I don't understand. I mean, you shouldn't get all too close to Hero because you'll be setting yourself up to fail. Now I understand. You mean the Hero tends to trip people who get too close. I will remember him walk several paces behind him in the future. No, no, no. That's not what I meant. You're too dense to be a threat to me. Let's just go. Her obsession is weird. I will say that. Hey, I haven't seen this in a while. It's Grandpa's haiku book. Master of Dragons. Color white, blue, red, and black. The Dragon Master. Save those beyond power she surrendered, dearest Althena. Morgan may be fat, and he may sweat like a pig. His glandure, heavy, heavenly bodies. Eyes gaze upward in reverence. Goddess in the thong. What? Wrapped by darkness, remember love and friendship. Be human and free. No, you love me, my fluffy, majestic hair. Please call me Nash. Ramfar is the man. Watch him roll his loaded dice and rob people blind. Azure is the sky shining down on us below. Our past, our future. Boy, Grandpa's really talented. Dragon Master, born to protect the goddess. Love ends evil. Pink flying cat. Flaming breath and acid tongue. Red dragon ruby. Assembly of gods and damnation of the world. A new beginning. I fear for my heart, and for the flesh torn clean by a nipple yanker. Flames burn through my lungs, consuming all that oppose a young red dragon. Some of those, like, it literally talked about the Althena sacrificing her power. Also mentioned Nash, which is some psycho shit. Like that held spoilers in it. Oh no, I didn't want to. Lunar, darkness to light, Athena, dying blue star, and came to the star. Wonder. Of Athena, the guys of love, Athena, children, or dragons, combined power, dragons shield our world from evil, creatures are that, Vane, the magic city, magic emperor used the evil power to blast Vane from the heavens. Yeah, that's right. They did, like, fire a giant cannon at Vane from the grinder. Okay, my boy. The boat's ready to sail. Find the priest and save Lucia from this curse. What do you mean, Grandpa? Aren't you coming with us? Lord, no, little one. I'm too old for this sort of thing now, and I know you'll be fine. Got you well, hero, and you're a bright boy. You make me proud. The Grandpa? No buts about it, young man. Besides, I've got a million books to catch up on, so get good moving. Remember you to seek out Ronvar when you get to LARPA. Any secrets? I assume no. Kitties, you have wandered a long way from home to end up here. Life is a great town. If you're, if it's crawling with criminals and you're a little too uh, fresh-faced. I want to explore Dalton's port city to the west. I hear they even have law enforcers there. Cool equipment. Hell yeah. Oh. Oh, and Papa each have three jobs, so I work at the store instead of going to school. That's just what Papa told me to tell you. Don't be sad. You can buy something. Thank you. 
Hell yeah, armor. Hmm. I feel like the dagger is still better. Two attacks with 37 is better than one with 49. I feel like the next weapon's gonna be hard. Oh. This didn't actually equip. No shield yet. I assume he'll come with his own mace. Ronvar, what kind of business do you have with that filthy dog? Simply that little life chewed me out of my house in a game of chance. Those dice were as loaded as the losers who stumbled out of the tavern on cheap drinks last night. I had the best view in Western Larpa, and now I live in a tent down by the river. Tell me you're in cahoots with that shameless pig. Yeah, there was the old uh, down by the river reference. Hearts lend 100 silver to a guy who's down in the luck. Critter named Joe in the 7th Camel Race on the day. You can make me filthy rich. All I need is a little cash and place a bet. Gamblers in town are big on IOUs. Why should we give you our money on a gambler who's lost all of his own cash? Between you and me, this looking man of all LARPA is around far. He's so dreamy. And dice are in. His big, strong hands, it's magic. Renfer always gets the rolls he needs. He just gets the roll he needs. They don't call that magic, they call it cheating. And Dalton just arrived and we got to load up the cargo. Wanna watch? Whatever that cargo is, mister, it smells great. Pickled Salonian cactus. And it's very popular in Nada and Moribia. That's where this batch is headed. Pretty good by itself, but the real way is to eat it with foamy, frosty mug of ale. Hey there, land lovers. Help you with something? It's not a passenger ship, it's a freighter. A cargo to and from ports of fall. Why are you here in La why are we here in LARPA? We're picking up a big batch of pickled Salayan cactus. Chew, ah chew. Where am I? This isn't Ron Far's house. Oh great, I've blown my brains out sneezing. And the kids today, their heads are filled with nothing but bubbly flu. I was filled with juvenile delinquents who spend their days drinking and gambling. I'm trying to remember if there's anything to be found, like, on shelves or anything like that. Or if it's just item-based. Or, like, treasure chests. Larpa, town of Fair City. Wonderful. Visitors are required to pay a 1,000 entry fee to the city. Fun collected are used to cart care for the elderly. Larp is designed designated fee collector. I'll be happy to accept your cash along with any additional donations. You and Larp are beautiful, miss. Very you hear this often, but you're rather beautiful. Never seen garments like the ones you're wearing either. Some sort of ceremonial clothing? Your skin, so pale and perfect. As if you've never been in the sun. Gorgeous, simply gorgeous. My friend, say hello to the little one. Isn't he adorable? He has his father's gentle eyes and wide smile. He's going to drive the woman crazy. Look, little one. The flying pink kitty cat. Wave to the kitty cat. Oh, here, this baby's so cute. I don't think... I don't even mind if his mother thinks I'm a cat. Hey, little guy. You're the cutest baby ever. Oh, yes, you are. Oh, yes, you are. Carnation, freaky red thing flapping over your shoulder, boy. Calling freaky goober. I'm a red dragon, and you better show me some respect. Wahaha. I didn't know that they start, started putting red dragons in bite sized packages. Oh, really? I'll have you know that biting is just one of my million, many talents. Observe. Wah! You burned me, you runt. You know how hard it is to find a good man, Lar, but let me tell you, the only thing. Boys around here one is to gamble their lives away. That well, just won't do. I need a man who can hold on to his cash and fulfill my needs. Mm. This building's a sanctuary. Tina's chosen decided to move into LARP a few days ago. Although they didn't exactly receive a warm welcome from the owner of the gambling dens. Priests of the sanctuary say the end of the world is at hand. I think you may be right. 
you're looking for someone, do you need any help? I'm looking for Rompar. You won't find him in the sanctuary, that's for sure. Rompar traded the cloth for the dice. Holy is one of the chosen most powerful priests. I wonder why he changed careers. Well, if you really want to find Rompar, I'd search tavern and gambling dens. A treasure chest behind this building. I gotta go through it. The village are not only scoring all things chosen, they openly mock us. Forgive them, guys, for these nonistic heathens know not what they do. If only these peasants understood that singing, dancing, drinking, gambling are sinful acts. The most val valuable members of the Alpine's Chosen are allowed inside the Holy City of Pentag Pentagilia. Pentagilia. Not just anyone's allowed to enter the presence of the goddess herself. Yes, Athena is in the Holy City. If I continue to serve the goddess with all, her, all of my effort, I might be allowed into Pentagilia someday. Herb? Went all that way for an herb? My forefathers were brought to the world by the blue, from the Blue Star by the goddess Altina. I believe that there will come a time when Altina allows us to return to the Blue Star. We pray to the goddess with all our might. She will grant our every request with her power. We pray each and every day that Altina will take us back to the Blue Star. Living on the Blue Star. Blue Star sucks. There's nothing there. 101, 602, 603. All of today's donations? The people of Larva aren't just a bunch of heathens. They're also a bunch of tightwads. Who are you? I'm sorry, young man, but donations to Althena are strictly non-refundable. Um, I'm not here for a refund. My, fun, my friend has been cursed, and we've come here to find a priest who can lift it. His name is Ronfar. Can you introduce us to him? He's gotta be around here somewhere. Ronfar, that heathen has never set foot in this sanctuary. He never will. I'm told that you would dare to invoke such an infamous name in the sacred place. All that Ronfar will lift from your first friend is her money pouch. Rest assured that. What? The Gramp Gwyn told us. I don't care what you heard. If you want to find Ronfar, search the tavern, not the sanctuary. I can't believe there was a time when that rogue was one of the chosen. The goddess Althena, your mind and body will grow strong. The more money you give the goddess, the more she will rejoice in your kindness. I see suspicion in your eyes, boy. You must have faith in Althena. Your donations will mean nothing. I think the blue star is beautiful. I sure do. Heck, I could stare it all night long. You know what they should do to the sanctuary? They should open, or they should rip the roof off. Don't you guys think so? You to crush, crush your hopes and dreams, Blondie. What will you do when it rains? Well, okay. Do you know what they could do? They could paint the blue star on the ceiling. We'll have NPCs. Thanks, Ray. Turned you away. Turned your friend away. Why am I surprised? Do the work of a goddess, but all they seem to do is collect people's hard earned cash. You need some medical attention. Why don't you wait till Ronfer comes back home? Yes, Rumford used to be a priest, but he's certainly not a member of Altina's Chosen anymore. Why'd he leave? That's none of my business. None of yours. I don't care about this past. I care about him coming back home and curing my dang athlete's foot. There is a lot of text in this game. Oh, buddy, what are you doing over here? Look at this boy. Kitty boy. wants to show up on stream unlike the rest of our camp. So cute. Oh, they have multiple lines if you keep talking to them too. That's a lot. I just like that there's a lot of banter with the like NPCs. Or with the characters too. Look at him. Look at this boy. Giddy. Finally got a cat that doesn't care too much about being held. He's not like those cats you see in like videos and stuff where people just ragdoll him around, but okay. He 
He's very cute, but he's also still in explore mode, so he like looks around all the time. Constantly just going through things. Yeah. There's sometimes where he'll sit on my old chair that's next to me. He'll just sit on that and like... But then every like five or ten minutes he gets up and like tries to walk across the table and knock all the stuff I have up here down. Buy some sweet, sweet fruit right here, right now. Only 500 silver each. Get yeah, while it's fresh. Kid, girl looks like she's about to faint, but she needs a big bite of fresh fruit. No way, hero. This... Cheesler is charging outrageous prices. They are looking for Ron Fire? Well, he's a pretty secretive kind of guy. He doesn't usually like to be bothered. Talk. Go ahead and take your chances. Talk to the guy at the back of the bar and hold on to your wallets. You might think I'm just a lousy stinking bar wind. You may be right, but I wasn't always. There was a time when I was one of the more popular singers in all Moribia. Fortunately, I had to get the habit of getting drunk and starting brawls with the customers. Think they can drink more than I can. Only I have the goddesses on my side. I have a blue birthmark on my butt in the shape of the blue star. It's a sign of Athena's blessing. Three words, pal. Too much information. Are you sure that's not just a bruise from getting your butt kicked in bar fights? Yeah, you're right. That guy does have, like, multiple. That's my brother to the right. He and his friend are having a drinking contest. The rules are very simple. The first guy to spew his booze is the loser. Just giving my brother some breathing room. Didn't lose these contents be or contests before. That you don't know where Gronfar is? Well, go away and figure it out. You know the more than interrupt a man in the middle of a drinking contest? Bring me another brew, servant wench. I need to show my friends what lightweights they are. You kids are looking for Ron Farr. I'm surprised you haven't found him yet. Because he's the best looking bad boy in town. What a hunk. Keep your eyes peeled for the studliest man in LARPA. That'll be Ron Farr, all right. So it's not this weird looking headband dude, right? Drunkard. With an actual, like, drinking animation. So, think I'm this Ron Farr guy, do ya? I ain't no stinking priest, okay? I mean, do I look like a priest to you? Now get on my sight, you little troublemakers, and don't come back here again. Unless, of course, you feel like rolling the bones. Hey, bud. What are you doing back here? I'm getting real sick of your face. <laughs> well, we're getting sick of your games, Ron Farr. We know who you are. I guess I was supposed to, like, wander around and talk to people. Like, what figure out who he was. With this Ron Farr guy anyway? You know, he's kind of a deadbeat. Huh. I can't believe he was ever a priest for Althena. But I'll tell you where your guy is, if you beat me in a game. Because the only truth I've ever found lies right here. In these! Yeah, the temple. Going in there and that talking to that one priest near the statue. Well, kid, aren't you gonna shoot the dice with me? Beat me, and I'll tell you all about Ronfar. So what will you bet? Even or odd dice? Even numbers. Uh, odd. Ha! I win. This Ronfar's secret past is gonna stay that way, unless you're willing to try again. Ready and willing. Even. Ah, it's hot. I win. This round for a secret pass and stay that way unless you're willing to try again. Even. Ah, it's hot. I win. Uh... Ah, it's hot. I win. Odd.
can't just give up. Come on, let's try again. Well, like super loaded dice against me, you big cheater. Let's keep our voices down. I hate to see you kicked out of here. No, I can't help me. Yeah, she's dying, you dick. What's wrong with this girl? Her skin's all cold and clammy. Tell you what, get out of here. She can rest at my place, and so can you. Come with me. Hey, buddy. Climb behind there. Hey. Hey! I'm watching you. I'm trying to steal things. Oh god, he's buying my cards. Okay, I'll see you later. I'm probably gonna stop in the next little bit anyway. Thanks for coming out and hanging out, Elamina. Little kitty cat. That does seem like a good stopping point for me as well. Cat's getting rambunctious. Save here. Next time we'll continue. Oh, two hours in. We playing Lunar again? I'm glad we beat Saga Frontier pretty early today, and it didn't drag on for an additional like two or three hours. Ugh. Good game though. Yeah, I'll be back uh, next time with more Lunar. See y'all later.